It's Friday night. Friday night. Basketball night. I'm hard, it's hard for me to get away right now because the Hawks are playing. Hope we got some Hawks fans. <laughs> How y'all doing? It's Friday night, cooking with Kip after dark. Hey, I hope you had a good week. It's still hot, isn't it? Mm -hmm. You hot, sweetie? No, I'm good. You sure? Mm -hmm. You sure you ain't sweating? Mm -hmm. <laughs> All right, so let's get this party started. Um, we're going to do some, uh, some, some wings tonight. Do you know what I can talk about first before we get started cooking? What? Juneteenth. Juneteenth. Tomorrow, right? Yep. We're celebrating. Hey, I think we've done it right in our country. Mm -hmm. We're celebrating Juneteenth. We've been celebrating it for a while around here. Mm -hmm. uh, but official holiday, you know, and um, I'm going to toast to Juneteenth because our forefathers did some stuff for us to make it possible that we can do what we do. And I salute them. Okay. Yeah. So we may talk about that later on. Alright, so I'm gonna cook some you know, I was I was looking at something earlier this week and I saw I'm a big lover of all kind of cultures. Uh, and Korean food is one of the things I like. Um, and another day we're gonna play around with some other stuff, but we're gonna make it simple tonight with some Korean fried wings, because it's Friday night and wings always good on Friday night. Mm -hmm. And uh, I'm gonna make a quick sauce, fry some wings. We're gonna do it like a double fry. We're gonna fry it twice, babe. Okay. We'll fry it once and then fry it again. We're going to make up a good little sauce and have some fun with it. So uh, I got some oil going. I'm in mom's kitchen today mm -hmm. because uh, what y'all been doing, Ty? Shucking corn. Shucking corn. <laughs> <laughs> Ladies are cooking dinner for Father's Day and they, they, they on it, man. They already got started. We got some serious corn and uh, we're going to do some okra. In fact, Mom's gonna, what's she gonna do, baby, tomorrow? Recreate, I already told mom. She's gonna redo the menu because we had some issues last week with connection. Hopefully, we're not having them tonight. Um, but we're gonna do some uh, fried okra again. And uh, mom's gonna go through the whole recipe so we can recap that. Thank you for all the people that checked mom out and all the birthday wishes. She, she was elated. That's as simple as I can put it. Okay. So, we're ready to get started, sweetie? Yeah, I'm going to say hi to a okay. few people. Right. Hello, Anthony Watford, Yolanda Cunningham. That little cat dancing gets me every time. Mm -hmm. Is it raining where you are, Anthony? Can y'all hear? Um, oh, hello. Louisiana. The Gulf Coast is getting some rain. Gail Bracey, yes. Um, Danielle, Anaya Watkins, Black Independence Day. Yeah, that's exactly what it is. Yes. That's our independence. Huh? Hello, Lisa, Sli Lisa Snotty, Shirley Turner, Evelyn Brown. Thank y'all for jump. Uh, yes, I'm feeling all right. I was letting him get his out. <laughs> um, Shirley Turner, Evelyn Brown, Mar Mary Bell, Lily Singleton, Sheila Miller, Lena Malone. Thank y'all for joining us. If you didn't hear earlier, he's doing some Korean Fried chicken. <laughs> yeah, yeah, but we're going to put a little Korean sauce on them. Uh, I need to grab some sauce. Thank you for the star, Sahara, Danielle, Anaya, um, Suzette Laws. It is blurry. Yeah, we thought we remedied that, but uh, <laughs> stay focused. I got it. Hello, Bert <laughs> Taylor. Somebody said stay focused, baby. Thank you, Mary Bell. I'm here. Hello, Gary Craig. Hello, Jacqueline White. Um, they're saying Happy Father's Day. Yeah. Yes, we at Mama's house. We at Mama's house. We've been shucking corn. They've been shucking corn. I mean, like, I don't know if you know oh. what a bushel looks like, but they're like two or three bushels. It was a bushel of corn. It like, was a lot right of there. corn. Mom, the grandkids. Yes. Everybody right there. Hello, Deanna DaCosta, Eunice Trent, Karen Joseph, Dorothy Lockridge. Thank y'all for joining. Tanya Stith, Kim Bynum. All right, so All right, Chef so is going to get, get started. started. I'm going to get started. So I got some chicken. I got my batter here. Um, so the first thing I'm going to do really is kind of move the side away for a second. Okay. Get everything seasoned up. So I'm going to put some rice vinegar on the chicken at first, and it's going into my sauce. Okay. So I'm going to pour a little bit of the rice vinegar on it. And I'm just going to season it with salt and pepper. And uh, we're going to fry it up, double batter it, and 
Then I'm gonna make the sauce while the chicken is doing its thing. So okay. I'm gonna put a little salt and pepper on there. Hello everyone. Just real simple, but the sauce is what's gonna be, I think, the magic of it all. Stay focused. Hello, Kip and Ty. I hope you are enjoying your Juneteenth off. No, it's not raining. It's approximately 84. It's hot. It's hot than fish grease. It's about 184 here. Huh? Hello, Dominique. Dodd. Hello, Letitia Mumford. Debbie Hawkins. Thank y'all for joining us. Okay. So he's seasoning up the chicken. Yeah. So we're going to season it up, and then we're going to... Uh, I'm going to do my little batter. So I got some seasoning on it. And I don't, I'm not going too heavy because uh, there's some seasoning. If you missed it a few minutes ago, mm -hmm. rice wine vinegar, salt, and pepper. Okay. So it's going to give it some interesting flavors. And the rice wine vinegar and toasted uh, sesame seeds in it as well. Okay. So it gives it a flavor. So, so we're going to get started. Wait, let me check my oil. Ruth, we're going to cut the corn off the cob. And for Father's Day, we're going to have fried corn. And then the rest is going in the freezer. <laughs> Hello, Susu. Hello, Ernestine Lott. Deanna DaCosta. Can I do this with tofu, uh, Deanna says. But the, uh, this? The, yes. That's a good question. I mean, I've used tofu, but I've never fried it. As so, a meat substitute? Yeah, I've never fried it, but uh, I'm sure it probably would work. Mm -hmm. uh, I'm trying to think of a good, if you fry tofu in it, and it holds together well, which I've only just kind of seared it, it probably would work. Okay. Because you're just going to put the sauce on it and give it the flavor. Yeah, and you it's know. pretty sturdy, so it should hold up. You know up. what probably would work well with this, too? What? Uh, cauliflower. Mm. Cauliflower. I, I would recommend cauliflower. Instead of tofu? Because I, I, I haven't used tofu that much. Okay. I've seared it, but I've never fried it, so that's what I would recommend. What's up, Sharon Brown? What's up, sis? Okay. So, K. Ron said him and the wife on the way. He said he on the way? K. Ron Bacon, he yes. He's supposed to be cooking those salmon patties right now. <laughs> Hello, <laughs> Kara T. Short. Jason Moore, let's get the party started. All right. So we're going to get it going. I got full wings here. So we're going to put, uh, we're going to start off with a few in the flour. And I'm going to come to the uh, wet, and then we'll come back to the flour. Susu says she's seen the tofu fried before. Okay, all right. Yes. What's up, Susan Adrian? You're welcome. So rice wine vinegar. Rice wine vinegar, salt and pepper. That's all that's on the chicken. Thank you, Carrie and Denton. I'm not putting anything in the flour. Normally I season flour, but I got uh, a lot going on with the sauce. So I think we'll be okay. All okay. right. Hello, Latanya Anderson, my big sister. So we're gonna go wet and then we're gonna go back in the uh in the dry. In the dry. Okay, so that's just flour. Normally I use three, but I got a little bit of limited space here, so we're just going to use back and forth. They're saying Happy Father's Day, baby. Hey, happy Father's so Day much. to all the men on the live yeah, currently. No I hope y'all are getting... This is our time to celebrate. And in my wet batter, it's some buttermilk, um, some egg, a little bit of water, mm -hmm. and uh, I did throw some seasoning into the... Uh, to the wet batter. Uh, is that plain flour? Self-rising flour. Self-rising? Yeah. Gary Craig said, what's so, the grape juice? The grape juice is actually, <laughs> when I have wings, I like a cold beer. And I got an IPA. It's a, I took that shirt off. Yeah. Goose Island. I had, actually kept the shirt on. I had a Goose Island IPA tonight. <laughs> Deanna said her husband always say, what is Kip cooking? Thank you for the stars, Charlene <laughs> Hamilton. <laughs> yes. Yes, fried corn. Tina is doing fine. Thank y'all for asking Gail Moore. She is home recuperating. Hello, Vonda Anderson, James Hamilton. Thank y'all for all the prayers. So let's check out the oil because we're going to get to frying this, this thing in just a second. We ain't going to mess around with it. We're going to get <coughs> Can you come a little closer, babe? Yeah. I wanted to get too blurry. So I'm getting ready to go in. I said that like I'm getting ready to. Where was the Does oil? It? It's Three. at 338, 340, because I'm double frying the chicken. Okay. So, Hello, Alice Riri. I'm going to show y'all the process of what I'm doing here in a minute. So we deep frying, of course. I'm shaking off a little bit, getting the batter off, putting some wings in. Good evening, Gwen Slaughter Pounds. Vonda Anderson says, Happy Father's Day. Enjoy your day. 
Yeah, we're cooking the spread. We're cooking the spread, us oh, women folk. <laughs> I'm looking forward to that. Yes. All right. So the, I got four wings in now. Thank you, Lisa Snotty. So we're going to start right there. I'm going to take that out, take that off a little bit. Okay. So I got the wings are cooking. I'm going to go ahead and get the sauce a working. Okay. So with the sauce, I'm going with the vinegar, that same vinegar that I used again, the rice wine vinegar. How's the reception, babe? I think it's doing well. Um, so I'm going to use it about half a cup rice wine vinegar. Maybe, yeah, about a half a cup. You're starting on the sauce. So half a cup of white wine vinegar. Rice. Rice, rice wine, wine vinegar. vinegar. Yeah. Okay. Rice wine vinegar. About a quarter cup of soy sauce. In there. And that's salt. That's why I wasn't going too heavy on the chicken because of the soy sauce. The soy sauce is salty, yes. Okay. Gary Craig, we can't wait to see you, brother. Next week. Next week. Safe travels. Okay, so I got some grated ginger. Okay, going in the sauce. Going in the sauce. Going in the sauce. <laughs> Firm said if you buy the firm tofu and let it drain in a colander, it fries up crispy and we dip it in sweet soy sauce, lemon and jalapeno peppers. Try it sometime. Oh, yeah, we need to is, try though. to fry some tofu you on the live. <laughs> got a little garlic. I got this thing called uh, lemongrass. You can get it fresh, but I got it uh, some little concentrated one in a paste. Okay. Lemongrass paste. So like the flavor of that. we are going to, I am going to put the um, recipe for the sauce um, up on the page. Hello, Marion Jackson, Tracy Jones, Sharon Brown. Uh-oh, sis. Technical difficulties. She can't get the stars. Uh-oh, Sharon Brown can't? Kim Bynum didn't like the fried tofu. Okay. Probably have to add some herbs and seasonings. We'll have to try it. Hello, Itsy Shopper Murray. All right, got that in. Thank you, Marion Jackson. So I got the uh, lemongrass paste in, the vinegar, rice wine vinegar, soy sauce, garlic, garlic, a um, little bit of salt, just a touch, brown sugar, a little honey. Yeah, I'm going in with it, huh? Yes. Hello, Executive Chef Delisa Dorsey. Got a little honey going in here. Oh. Bishop Eddie Terrell Ball said that's for the preacher's table for <laughs> Sunday, right? <laughs> for the preacher's table. Preacher's always in the house. All right, so I got that in. I'm going to stir this up a little bit. Hello, Lolita. Tracy Meyer Scully. And we're going to put a little bit of Korean uh, pepper flakes in it. Okay. Chili flakes. And they're really not that hot. I've used these before on a couple of items. Gail Moore, you are officially on the welcome committee, sis. <laughs> she done welcome everybody in it. All the new people. She just welcome everybody. Yes. All right. So the sauce is going. I'm going to put one other thing in there. Hello, Dan Bill. Um, Lisa says she's been using her Burba Ray in her soups, and it's so delicious. All I'm right. addicted to the great seasoning. Right, Thank right. you. And a little butter. It ain't good unless I put some butter in it. And I know y'all probably missed some of this, but I'm going to post the recipe for the sauce. So he'll take the fried chicken wings out and toss it in the sauce. Thank you, so Danielle. Gonna let that kind of cook down. It's going to thicken up. All right, and then I'm going to add a few more things. So I'm going to check out where the wings are right now. Okay. Uh, Hello, Mary Lynn Abbott. She enjoys our page. Thank you. Hello, Mary Bell. If you haven't already, um, if you enjoy a video, a, a video that you see, don't mind sharing, please. Hello, is it the trees? All right. Let's see how these wings are doing. Susu. Gary Craig. Uh, so I'm not frying the wings real fast because I'm going to fry them twice. I'm just tighten it up a little bit. That's turn it down lower than what I wanted to. Hello, Malva Hall. Okay, so they're doing, go, doing okay. They're I'm going turn good. it up a little bit, though. Okay. So you're going to get some more ready? Oh, 
guess this is coming. Okay. Yeah, I'm gonna get some more wings ready. What are you sipping on tacos? What? Susu, so, so, but um, Garrett Craig was pressuring me to go live cooking. So he was, he was pressuring on Father's Day. <laughs> so we're gonna have to do a little snippet. Okay. Hello, Malva Hall. So I'm gonna get the other wings ready to go. I'm gonna go with four in here. Thank you for the stars, uh, Marilyn Abbott Stewart. Steph P, what you sipping on, Ty? Because you focus like a mug. <laughs> Hello. You get us something to loosen up a little bit, don't we? Hello, Susan Adrian. Thank you, Danielle Anaya. So he's just prepping some more chicken to go in the hot grease. All right. So I got those in. These will be coming out in a moment. Hello, Isabel Larry. I'm going to stir this up a little bit. Turn it down. Thank you, Detrice. I'm going to taste it and see where we're at with this. Okay. You're going to taste the sauce? Yeah. It's got to cook a little bit more. But. I will. I know. It was, it was love pressure. It was big brother pressure, Gary Craig. I like the way that's going, baby. You do? Yep. I'm going to have to remember. I think I got it. I think I got it. You got it? I may not even have to ask. I got to kick it up a little bit. Babe. Not much. It ain't even spicy right now. All right. All right. Your mama going to eat a wing or two. <laughs> we going to serve up some. We ain't going to raise them all up. Okay. So the wings are cooking. They're looking good. I'll tell you what I want to do the next time with the Korean uh, chicken. Which one do, We're baby? We're going to take the whole chicken. Oh. We're going to do it outside. We're, We're going to take doing... the whole chicken and put it in the oil. And then it, toss it. It is unbelievable. It's going to be crunchy. It's going to be good, but we're just going to do some wings tonight. Thank you for the stars, Lisa. We're at Mom's house cooking, Itsy. Thank you, Tracy. I'm a good, I'm the hostess with the mostest. Mostest. Okay, so I'm going to get these a little browner. Okay. So with the batter, the wet batter, uh -huh. does that just ensure the flour stays on, or is that uh, contributing just, to the moisture of the chicken? Nah, it's just going to give it a different crunch. This is going to have a pretty good crunch to it, too. That's why I'm frying them twice. Mm -hmm. um, but they should be pretty. They're good and flaky. Okay. Um, yes, Steph P. So the special guest, if y'all don't know, um, Kip lost his sister in 2018 to pancreatic cancer. Um, so he had two sisters. Um, and she had a son, our nephew, which we hadn't seen in a while. Uh, they live in North Carolina and he came home, him and his dad came and surprised mom for her birthday. Okay. <laughs> Susan said, where are your shoes, Kip? Oh, you're so tired of folks show that. <laughs> Hello, now, Alicia actually, Dotson. I'm going to tell you about that in just a second. <laughs> I'm going to tell you about that. No shoes. <laughs> Good evening, Kip and Time family. Hello, Tracy. Yes. Hello, Pamela Tripp, Monica Collins. Actually, I Tracy don't wear, Daniels. There's very few times I wear shoes in the house, y'all. Yeah. I'm gonna be honest with you. I'm a shoe. I'm a shoeless person. Hello. I just, I just put some red pepper flakes in that sauce. Just okay. Kick it up a notch. Yeah. Hello, Gwendolyn Evans. Yes. So he came home. Hello. Uh, yes, that was Gwendolyn Evans. He came with his dad, and they came and surprised mom. So we pulled up from church, and they were in the yard. And we were trying to throw her off that it was somebody from the church bringing her something. And she said, no, that ain't. That's my baby. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so. Okay, so the chicken is cooking pretty good. So I'm going to give it a few more moments. It's not going to be quite ready mm -hmm. because I'm going to cook it one more time. Okay, one more time. One more time. Hello, one, Tamika one more Peters. Here. Okay, so here's what the sauce is looking like. Thank you, Gwendolyn Evans. It's thickening it up a little bit, so as it cooks, I wanted to thicken it up a little bit. Okay, so if you're just joining, we're doing um, Korean barbecue wings? No. No? no just just a, Korean fried just chicken. There you go, fried All right. Yeah. <laughs> no barbecue. Yes, Itsy, she cooked those whole cakes. So she's going to cook some more okra. Um, Tomorrow. 
Lolita said, do you prefer cooking on that gas stove? Yes, I do. Yes, we do. <laughs> That's why I'm here. Yes, thank you so much. Who is that? Gail Moore, are you officially on the welcome committee, sis? Hello, Hello Isabel Larry. <laughs> All right. We're going to put these back into the wet. And back into the dry. Hello, Lynn Day from Arizona. Thank you for joining. So I have to, if you missed earlier, I did wet, I mean dry. Wet, wet and dry. Dry. Mm -hmm. So we're doing that again. Yes, Trace. The gas stoves are everything. I'm going to do that again. All right. There we go. So the sauce. I'm going to see if I can remember. Rice, wine, vinegar. Yep. Honey. Yes. Garlic. Yes. Ginger. Yes. Sesame seeds. Oh, yeah. No, I haven't put the sesame seeds in. Sesame oil. Sesame oil. Mm -hmm. Crushed red pepper. Yes. Uh, Korean, hot sauce. Korean flakes. Korean flakes. Korean flakes. Pepper flakes. Pepper flakes. A lot of this. That chicken looks so good and it smells delicious. So you didn't marinate these wings or not. anything? I did not. Okay. Because I didn't really marinate because of the, what's going on. Big one, Gwendolyn Evans, hi Kip family, love to see you cook. Kip, I had my surgery on June 2nd. I wait to see my doctors to move. I hope I have a good from surgery. I believe I will. Oh. Amen. Good. So I'm actually skimming as I'm using this big basket so I can skim out any little flakes, and there's not many in there. So okay. <laughs> one more time, one more time. Hey, hey, Lisa Snoppy. Hey. Lemongrass paste, yes, yes that's lemongrass lemon paste. paste. That's yeah. right, I forgot that. One. Gary Craig said, "You barefooting, you barefooting." <laughs> All right. Yes, it does smell good. Uh, okay. Smell good. So we're going to go in with some more chicon. Chicon. Yeah. Uh, Brianna Taylor, yes, it is going to be delicious, especially with the crispiness. I'm excited. It ain't nothing like a good crispy, crispy piece of chicken. Hot piece of chicken. That's right. Alright. Oh, I might should put an apron on. Mm-hmm. Yes, <laughs> thank you, Gail Moore. Let me put that down. <laughs> Use my hand. So what we're gonna have with the chicken? Now, we're just gonna have some wings tonight. Just some wings. Friday night wings. I'm I'm I can dig it. Hello, Debbie Hawkins. Alright, so we're gonna go in with some more wings. I don't wanna go too far to the oven because I, I don't wanna start sweating for one. And we might get we might get a little blurry. So we got some recep good reception right now? Yeah, uh it's decent. Okay. Yes, they are big wings. Yeah, they are. Them, them wings that uh, was working out. <laughs> they were pumping iron. <laughs> they might have been, baby. Yeah, they were pumping iron. Thank you, Evelyn Brown. Oh, let's see where the oil is. We're going to bring the wings up close. Up close. I promise. I got to get back up the tip. I like the tips myself. Like the tips, baby? Yeah, I like the tips in a good flat. I guess that's the whole wing game. <laughs> mm -hmm. Let me wipe out. Okay. okay. So what y'all doing this Friday night? Are y'all prepping for a big... I would tell y'all what's on the menu, but the men folk here. We are in Georgia, close to Savannah, Georgia. Yes. We're doing great. Yes, some pretty wings. Pretty. Hello, Laquita okay. Knight. Thank you for joining. Yes, I'm going to post the recipe. He did a uh, wet, dry batter, and he fried them twice. Well, I fried them once, and I'm going to fry them one more time. Okay, he's going to fry them one more time. Thank you, Ruth Golf and Smith. So we're not quite there yet. Deborah uh, DeMoney from Harlingen, Texas. Thank you for joining us. All right. And then I'm going to garnish them with some sesame seeds, some black and white. And a little bit of green onions in the minute, but we'll toss them in the sauce. Uh, all of them ain't got to go in the sauce. Either. No, we won't do them all in the sauce. Okay. Yeah. yeah. Let's save some Bird out. Lines. We're going to do the next round, and uh, I still have a few more over there. Right? Lolita says she hated frying chicken as a kid. She hated to get popped with that hot grease. <laughs> Sis, I know. I know. <laughs> you put quick, it in there and run. <laughs> Quick on your feet. I prefer frying in a pot versus a pan because the pot, you don't get too much of that backsplash. Al is working 9 to one third of tomorrow. Me too, Ty. I love the tips and flats. Welcome. Thank you. 
Tracy said we're making her hungry. <laughs> Give me a few more seconds on that oil. You bringing it back up to temp? Yeah, bring okay. it back. I want to get around 335, 340. And that's a good idea. If you um, clean your oil in between frying, it'll save on all that uh, drippings dropping to the bottom and burning. Hello, Keisha Cooks. Happy Friday. I will go over our Sunday menu with y'all, but the men folk listening. We want them to be surprised. Yeah, I want the they already know they're having corn because we just shook yeah. a whole bunch of corn. <laughs> hey, Steffi, thank you. Okay, so the oil is all. So, what I'm trying to accomplish with the oil is around 335, 340 on the first fry. Second fry, I'm going to kick it up to about 350 and, uh, <laughs> and fry them probably another five minutes or so. Donna Fluis Williams says she's doing her last crawfish boil Sunday oh of the season. I, the last one, I need to be there. We need to be there. The weather's okay for Donna over in Louisiana? I think they supposed to be getting some rain. Okay. Flats, flats, flats. That's Gracie. Lolita, I think she's running over here. <laughs> I think that's what that is. All right, so we're going to put some more chicken in the oil. So you always lay the chicken in the hot oil away from you. My grandma taught me that. Lay it away from you and that will prevent the popping. You see how he's laying it? Instead of it landing towards you, it lands away from you. Thank you, Christina Graham. Happy Father's Day. All right. There he is. Is that all of it? No, we got a treat. We got four more. Four more. We got four more. Babe, you better cook all that. We got a full house. Okay. Yes, flats, Karen Joseph. Cooking them all, baby. You cooking them both? I'm cooking. I got them working. <laughs> oh, it's raining. Yeah, it's raining. I got them working. I got them working. I got to use a little bit more butter milk. A little bit more? That's true. I'm going to start frying in a pot instead of a pan. Not as much popping yourself. Yeah. And you can control it better, especially those... Uh, I guess that's a cast iron. It is. Yeah, that's a cast iron, but it's painted. Cast iron pot. Enamel. Pot. Enamel. That's what I was trying to think of. Yes. Hello, Lady D. Welcome to the party. We frying some chicken wings. You can call them wings. They are wings, but we like to say wings. <laughs> it just sounds better. <laughs> All right, so we're going to put the last little dredge on these. <laughs> hey, Hattie McBride. Twelve wings, at least for uh, Garrett. Garrett, these some big old wings. Yeah. I want to see you eat twelve. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, these, these well. Okay, so I'm dredging these, these, going into my wet and then coming back to the dry. So dry, wet, back in the dry. Very windy now. Heavy rain coming. Should be over by Saturday evening. Okay. Yes, Donna. I'm sure y'all going to enjoy them crawfish. We ate some, but not as much as Kip would have liked. Oh, you're right. I need, an I need another season. Y'all see Mama Clean Pots hanging on that pegboard over there? Mama Pots look like she bust them out the box. Mm -hmm. They've been there for years. Been there for years, and she she used them too. They not on display. Mm -hmm. Just so you know. Hello, Vicky Spencer. Thank you for the stars. All right. Tracy Rousen, good evening. I was just cooking, and Lolita didn't realize it and thought she was smelling your chicken. Say what? Oh Lord, Dan said he was cooking and Olisa thought she was smelling the chicken. Oh, uh, what, she didn't realize what, he was cooking. What's she been drinking? I don't know. But did it go like this, Dan? Wait a minute. I know I don't smell this chicken. <laughs> that was one of those. She, she looked at her glass. Like. <laughs> All right. Come so. back to the light, sis. <laughs> okay. Wipe this off. Is that a Williams Sonoma pot, no manium? That was not. Nope, it is no. not. Yes, the pots. Yes, and she's had that pegboard up there for years, guys. And she used those pots. She don't play. She's had people bring food by, and they pots be looking, you know, like they can need a little love, and she done cleaned them up. That ain't my pot. Yes, it is, babe. I just cleaned it up. So she's well known around here for keeping clean, shiny pots. <laughs> Gail said she was drinking some Cisco. <laughs> Hello, Deanna Brown. Oh, <laughs> that was Lolita. <laughs> she looked at that glass like, what is this I'm drinking? 
I'm making me smell the chicken all the way in Texas, huh? Mm -hmm. All right, so. I got no, Lisa second, left. Second batch of chicken going. <laughs> You got a fire on that right side. It might be a little grease. What fire? It was building up. Where? Iron right, on the bottom of the pot. Oh. Probably the fan blowing it. Yeah. Alright, so let me get my tongs together. And, uh, Dang the wings look like look like small turkey wings. <laughs> That's Donna Fluid. <laughs> <laughs> she ain't never mind. They do. I know. And Gary Craig talking about 12. I can eat 12 of them drumettes. I, uh, I have to be hungry. No, I can eat 12. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So we're going to go back into the pot. I'm going to slow it down a little bit because I want to get a little crisp on it. Okay. So it's going to have any much water on it. So I still fry until I hear uh, the sizzle go down. But... Kip is pretty good about checking the temperature, internal temperature, but I'm, I go by the ear. You go by the ear, baby? I go by the ear. All right. That means you're a better cook than me. Yeah, you see, they are big. The wings get here, Craig. <laughs> I can eat about two of them. <laughs> All right, so that's working right there. Donna said. So we're going to get a few more minutes and then pull those up, and then the other ones are going to go back in. So how long did you cook the sauce? Till it reduced? Yes. It went to, you know what? I turned it off because I didn't want to cook it too much, but we're going to keep it low. Flats and tips for uh, Donald Fluis William. He was he was making, is this Pomi's free? So what? Lolita with Kalamata olive aioli smelling right mm -hmm. over here. Oh, P-O-M-M-E-S, free. Palm free. Palm free, y'all, y'all, y'all. potatoes. Fried potatoes <laughs> with color, model, olive oil. Yes. That's All right, now. I Dan. got it out. That's Dan. Dan. All right, Dan. Dan, she gonna treat you right tonight, boy. <laughs> yes, Tracy say uh, she go by the ear as well. Okay. All right. So we gonna let those fry just a little bit. Most wings, you know, we <laughs> about 14, 15 minutes on the wing. Yeah. So I'm doing You about fried them for 15 minutes? Yeah. Okay. Especially these big wings. Yeah, you need to fry them. <laughs> uh, 12 to 15 minutes. Lena Reed say, uh, y'all, I'm going to kill this. It's a Korean dish. Per gogi? Bogogi. Per. She say per. per. Is it bo? I thought it was bogogi. Well, per and bo, y'all get it together. She might have another dish that I'm not familiar with, huh? <laughs> yes, Marilyn, Marilyn said, my husband can eat 10 wings when it stops close to the top it's time to get them out of the grease yes i agree when they can start floating sis yes that's debbie hawkins mm -hmm. judy and this chicken keep looking at me with these big old eyes <laughs> judy looking at the chicken baby no she said the uh, uh love like mama's it. kitchen so nice and clean yes she keeps everything nice organized uh -huh. okay. this is where kip learned how to cook this is where the magic happened uh -huh. This was the learning board right here. <laughs> Alright, so we're gonna get ready to come out with these. Okay. I fixed my men folk, my husband, some some Mexican for Friday night festivities over here. Alright, Tracy. That's different. It sounds like it I'm sure it went well. It ain't you can't never go wrong with Mexican cuisine. Yeah, the wings big. <laughs> they big. Yeah. They big. I probably won't eat one of them. Alright. So I got the last four. You gonna wait to fry them? Yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and put them in. You sure? Right. Hello, Danette Mance. Right. She's another chef that likes to get down in the kitchen. Shaking them, boss. I'm shaking them. Shaking them what movie that's from? Hello, Tuscan, Arizona in the house. I'm shaking them, boss. I'm shaking them. You don't know that No, movie, he said I'm. No, that, that is a movie. That's cool, Hand Luke. No, I don't know that movie. <laughs> so the man in life stole it from Cool Hand Lou? He didn't say I'm taking him, boss. Who, what'd he say? He said something else. Uh, he said the gun line, boss. <laughs> I don't know what he said. <laughs> but he didn't say I'm shaking. That's Cool Hand Lou. Who is Cool Hand Lou? That's for my time. Yeah, baby. Hello, Carol you know Dunn. You that made the salad dressing? What salad dressing, baby? $1,000? No, like, this is Paul Newman. 
Paul Newman, yes. He was in that movie. He was? Yeah. All right. I'm dating myself, aren't I? Yeah, it's all right. With age comes wisdom. Yeah, all right, so we're going in with this last batch, batch of wings. Last batch of wings going in. Hello, Janice. Al Koser. I think I said that correctly. Thank you for joining us. Yummy chicken wings. Yes, and he made a good Korean sauce. He's going to shake them around in. All so right. the batter was wet, dry, wet, or dry, wet, dry. Hey, One of them. <laughs> dry, wet, dry. All that what you just said. All that. <laughs> the order might be different, but you know what I'm saying. All right, so last wing. Thank you for the stars, Queen Bacon Jones. Right, Thank so you for sharing the net. Okay. If you all um, watched the okra video with mom cooking the okra, we're going to redo the okra. She's going to start from the beginning to the end because a lot of y'all wanted to see her finish that out. So we'll be doing that tomorrow. So make sure you tune in. Yes, we're doing wings. Uh, and he's going to toss them in a Korean sauce. Donna Lewis Williams, fried wings and fried rice. Manchu in New Orleans. Did anybody turn y'all on to them holding Manchu. a rock? I never went to Manchu, but I know what you're talking about. Somebody told me about it. <laughs> so, so I got to get by this next. What's his name, my Gail Moreland, you have it. That was Gail that said that? No, she said wisdom should have kept you out of the church from stealing that communion. I thought we were cool, Gail. You sent me a nice <laughs> message today. And then you're going to. Boy, I tell you what. If y'all, it'll be your own people. people. <laughs> but you know it's love when it's your own people. Well, some folks you can't tell stuff to. They tell everybody. Danielle says she's moving back to Georgia in October. Welcome, welcome. Yeah, Itzy says more. she loved the movie Cool Hand Luke. Who did? Yes, uh, Itzy Chapel. Okay, so she know what I'm talking about. Um, oh, I need to tighten up. Yes. Uh, myself, my sister-in-law, and our sister is going to uh, do the cooking on Sunday. The men folk going to be sitting around chilling. No, we hadn't tried Manchu, but I feel like I've, I've missed out. No, we, we didn't go there, but uh, I'm familiar with this. Though. All right. <laughs> Danette said, I done hollered. I have to get into okra. Danielle, I'm telling you, make sure you're watching yeah, tomorrow evening. Yeah, sure. It's the uh, it's not slimy. It's to me. I've had it all. You ate it Sunday, baby. I mean last week. Yeah, I ate that okra. What you think happened to? Him? <laughs> we was trying to save some for the other people. They almost they was close to not getting in it. <laughs> all right, let's get this last. I almost turned my oil down too low. I gotta get it back up. All right, stay focused. That's right. Everybody. Uh, Co-signing on Donna Fluids talking about Manchu is the bomb, the infamous purple building. Yes. No, no one turned us on. We, we, I feel okay. neglected. Feel neglected. Missed out. Mm -hmm. Yes, sir. We go by there in July. Okay. All right. Donna Fluids beat us in uh, New Orleans in July. We'll be there hanging out. Hanging out. That was Lola's request, by the way. I want to go to New Orleans for the day. <laughs> yeah, going to the so you gonna put? That chicken back in the oil? It's going back in the oil. It's not ready yet. It's not? Mm-mm. Look ready to me. We're going to get one more private. <laughs> We're going to get one more little quick private. Kick kick up the, the engine on the car. We're going to fry it again and get another little crisp on it. Then I'm going to pour the sauce, which getting that extra crispy on it when I put the sauce on it is going to still have the crunch and the sauce. And the sauce. It's not going to, it's not going to weigh it down too much and make it soggy. All right. All right. That's why you the so that's, chef. That's what that's all about. All right, Danielle. Thank you. Yeah, I'll you be looking gravy, for you. You put the gravy on the sauce and it makes it... It makes it nice. almost like now, smother. Tomorrow, tomorrow it will be. But not yeah. Um, what day we coming? Uh, the week of the 19th. Yes. So I think it's going to be like that Thursday or that Friday. Our birthdays are the 20th and the 21st. Mm -hmm. That's myself and Lola. She in there, she's sick of us because she was shucking corn too. I see who won the ball game right quick. We had Ollie cheering in his shucking corn. Mama had like two bushels of corn. It was a blessing too, but we got them all shucked. 
Got it all yes, in. we're doing two fried then it. Hello, Alice Cruz. Oh, it's lose. Hey, y'all from Bass Strip, Louisiana. That's Brenda Gardner. Baby, the hawk. Uh, baby just found out the hawk's gonna lose. You gotta stay focused. I know. <laughs> we ain't burning I'm no chicken. You had some money on the game. No, I don't bet. You don't bet. It's all hard, baby. Good evening, Janet Fields. Thank you for joining. We're doing fried chicken with a Korean sauce. Okay. Mama resting as her soon fingers. As soon come out, we're going to go in with the first first chicken. And uh, we're going to fry it up, and then we're going to put it, uh, toss it in some sauce. Have a good night, Dolores. Thank you for joining us. I'm going to let you taste the sauce, baby. See what you think. Gary Craig, shucking corn and... I might need to add a little bit of something to it. That's fine with me. Like it? Yeah. yeah. That's pretty darn good. Everything good. I'm going to add just a little bit of honey to bring up. Shell and peas and shucking bit. corn was never fun to me as a child. Me either. But I enjoy it as an adult. <laughs> I appreciate it as an adult. Yes, Gail Moore, Wednesday wind down. If you ain't in the place, you ain't nowhere. Sorry about missing it this Wednesday. Yes, we had a, a friend in town, so we... Um, spent some time with her. What's your favorite restaurant in the N.O.? That's Marilyn Abbott. Mm, my favorite? Whew. Willie Mae's Scotch House. Uh, Willie Mae's is up there. Willie Mae's Scotch House is right up there. We uh, went to Commander's Palace, but that's not our favorite. Yeah, Commander's good, but it's not our favorite. Drago's is good. Drago's high. It's so bad. You know what it is for me? Houston. Really? Houston. Okay. I like the one on. I like you. You're not my favorite in the city, but it's good. Um, we will marry in Jackson. Yes, we shook so corn. Yeah, I've enjoyed. There's a lot of places I've enjoyed there. I can't. I can't say a favorite because we don't enjoy a lot of restaurants. Yeah, yeah, I have. Yes, Candy. We had a friend in town that I hadn't seen in a while, so we went to spend some time with her. All right. So we're going to get this about ready. Tia said, I'd rather shut corn and shell peas. Yes, Houston. No about that. <laughs> Hello, Sue. Donna said, just know Manchu is a hole in the wall, which means we need to go in the daytime. That's fine with me. <laughs> I'm picking up what you're putting I'm down, a, I'm sis. I'm a hole in the wall kind of guy. I can do that. Rita Bryan, I was wondering what we was going to do with all them corn husks. She said, dried corn silk tea has health benefits. Yeah, you can take corn husk and make moonshine. Too. I think she meant just the silk. You know. Yep. <laughs> Hold on. Uh, I'm just saying. Two sisters. Yeah, two sisters. Two we sisters. Went there for one day. What were we there for? Brunch. Brunch. Um, Donna said, "Neos." N e y o w. Across no, Neos. Neos. You remember we went? It's over there in the. Uh, in the Carrollton area. Okay. Right on the corner, you remember? You took me I, or somebody else? I took you. Remember I told you he came by my restaurant? And you went by his? Yeah. yeah. They okay. had great food too, baby. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> you called it me out. What you call it? Stay focused. <laughs> Hello, Martha Nelson. <laughs> Neo. <laughs> Neo. Uh, <laughs> thank you, Dennis. <Danette. laughs> uh, all right, so we're going to take this out. We're going to get with the final fry. All right. Latanya why she got her order. She said she got a secret wonder season who filled all the way to the top, and she loved it. <laughs> she got a secret. But I accidentally put too much in there? No, babe. I, no. Mm -hmm. <laughs> That's all right, let's take these out. Okay, the silk they sell is in Mexican stores for the tea. Okay. Yes. Thank you for the stars, Barbara C. Simmons. Thank y'all for the love. It's a bunch of chicken over there. Yeah. So, oh, someone asked how long you gonna fry it the second time? About five minutes. Five minutes. Four to five minutes. I, but I'm gonna base that on the visual thing. Okay. Patricia Ann Farcloth. Faircloth, I'm sorry. My son hated shucking corn, worked my garden for a lot of years, not able to do it anymore, but raised on the farm. Yes, I enjoy now as an adult 
the farm life, which we don't farm. Farm living is the. That ain't what the thing say. Cletus, stay focused. What is that? Green acres. Green acres. Nah. Farm living is the life for me. <laughs> Something like that. Latoya said, no accident. That was just right. All that seasoning. That heap of seasoning. <laughs> <laughs> I love to shell peas and shuck corn All as right, a kid. A oh, her dad finally bought a pea sheller. That's Susu. A pea sheller. A pea sheller. Child, we, yeah, we, we had a pea sheller too. We did, growing up. It was a pea sheller. Me. <laughs> <laughs> Lord, Automatic. Yes, Lord. Shell peas, boy. <laughs> and ain't no do you want to. Get in here and share some of these peas. <laughs> and you, right. you had to shell them when you hated eating them. Gary Chris said, not Green Acres. <laughs> <laughs> Y'all don't never know right. what song in his head. So we're going to get this all back up like 365. Okay. 355. About 350. Patricia said she just finished watching Green Acres. <laughs> really? <laughs> Josh <Jean> Gabor. <laughs> wow. I haven't seen that in a while. All right, give me like three or four more minutes. We get the oil back up temp. We're gonna put those in. Okay. Then we're gonna uh, toss some some of the uh, wings in a sauce. Let me get a platter. Thank you, Dr. Kimberly Johnson, for the stars. So keep keep on well. Know your age sooner than you think. What's next? I dream of Jenny. <laughs> She said, if you keep on, we're going to know your age sooner. What's next? I dream of Jeannie. <laughs> yes, yeah, shelling purple hull peas was the worst. Your fingers be a hot mess. You have pea juice all under your thumb. <laughs> no, my fingers be sore from shelling peas. Hello, Marsha Potter. We are in Mama's kitchen frying up some chicken on this yeah, lovely so Friday night. We're doing some Korean wings tonight. We're doing it Korean style. He's made up a sauce that we're right, going to toss some in. He's about to do the second fry on them. Y'all just joining. This is a two fry process. Two fry. Two fry. Hello, Billy Jones. Happy Father's it's Day. He said Happy Father's Day. Thank you, sir. Uh, that was a meal, right? Billy yes. Jones. Have y'all eaten at the Gray? Yes, we have been to the Gray. Donna oh, Fluis, yeah. what you know about she that? Oh, she said just saw her on a Juneteenth special. Yes, the Donna, chef. Donna, let me tell you, the Gray is the bomb. The bomb diggity. Yeah. It was like my, we first moved here, September would be five years. Mm -hmm. um, that was like the third stop I made. I went there before Ty got here. Mm -hmm. Ty and Lola went here. And I just stopped by one day, one afternoon after work. And uh, by myself, just chilling, sat at the bar. And the next thing I knew, I was by myself. I had like a $150 tab, baby. <laughs> I said, God, duh. <laughs> How'd that happen? <laughs> Where this happen, man? The Gray don't play. But it was good. Um, the Gray has a great history behind it, yeah. too. It as be well the, as used to be the, Gray the African American chef, yes. <laughs> Female African American yeah. chef, uh, executive yeah. chef. She is bad to the bone, too. Yes. Um, thank you, Latanya Washington. I moved to New York, from New York to South Carolina at the age of 12. What the heck is this, Mama? Grew to enjoy, but those first years was traumatizing for me. That's Carol Dunn. Country bumpkin. All right. Three more minutes, and all will be where I need it. How about them Beverly Hillbillies? <laughs> That's Deb August. <laughs> Going back, aren't they? Neos is a better choice. Man child Claiborne, hell to the no no. That's Ronda Remo <laughs> to no. each his own. God, no. You know what? We went one night, we had a good time. Hole in the wall? No, no well, it's like a hole in the wall. What the place baby went the guy asked for about the color oh, bread. Oh, uh Giacomo. Giacomo. Giacomo C I Yeah, yeah. He's like Ty. I said, man, can I have your cornbread? Nah, I ain't getting to that. No. <laughs> That's a Wednesday wind up. Yeah, it is. <laughs> then he going he gonna you play that. He going to make that, that smart comment, then going to buy us a drink. <laughs> yeah. He should have paid the whole bill. Yeah, he should have. Hello, Sharon Raglan right, from Claiborne. All right, so he's about to do the second fry. We're going to stay back chill. Back chill. Do you know Chef Keith Hicks? I don't think we do. It sound familiar, but I, I, I can't put, put nothing with it right now. Okay. So he got... A little piece of skin ain't going to make it, so... 
I, it, baby, you could let the skin make it. Mm. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> so the one thing I was gonna do, and I haven't done it yet. Shut up. Mel to think she's on my list when we come to Savannah. Let us know when y'all come, Donna. Hold a couple of holes into it. Okay. To release, to release some of that steam and that'll keep the crisp on the skin. And it'll get the inside where I want it to be. Yes, Gary Craig. That's the best food from a hole in the wall. Where the grease ain't been changed. <laughs> What'd you say, baby? But the fish still frying. I said, well, the grease ain't been changed in a month of Sunday. Hello, Jacqueline Stevenson. Thank you for joining. Patricia Ann, love all the old shows. I'm 71 years young. My 15th great, great grandbaby in July. Love some good fried chicken. Patricia Ann, wow. Congratulations on your new great, right, great so grand. I got the egg chicken fry going in. And it's crisping up even more. We're gonna pull it out in just a second. Babe, what? you keep, you keep. Even though look wrong, I'm just not wrong. The crumb snatcher. Oh, the crumb snatcher. Hello, Barbara Keeping. All right, they're about ready. Then they say, "Yes, God." The, the chicken say, "Shh." So, uh, Willie Mae Scotch House, that's some of the best fried chicken you ever want to have. Um, and it's a, a deep brown color. It's not like paper bag brown. It's a darker brown. I missed the beginning. Why too fry? Chef Carmen did it and I missed her reasoning. Oh, I'm not sure. Oh, okay. I didn't realize she done it. I did, for, we didn't realize she done it. Crispy skin. For crispy skin. Okay. <laughs> Donna said, I don't know if we want to go to Manchu. When we go to Manchu, I keep the car running and you go in. <laughs> Just like that? I thought she recommended it. <laughs> she did. The food, the food good. It must be in, uh, I can't call no area. Yeah, baby. Don't be. I'm Google it. <laughs> Latanya said, that sounds hey, like church's chicken. I enjoy Sweet Lorraine's as well. Be <laughs> Rhonda said, Donna Fluence. Sweet Lorraine's is a cool place. Yes, Sweet Lorraine's. I remember that. We tried to go to all of the little dives. I can't believe we don't know about Manchu. Yeah, I think we talked about going once, but we never got there. Yes, Danette, it is dark brown. Hello, Jeanette Silson, Martha Nelson. <laughs> Willie Mae, do some good white beans. Manchu got the mm -hmm. best chicken. It's in the Seventh Ward. That's Jacqueline. Okay. All right. Seven more. Seven more. Seven more. That's that chicken. That's that chicken. Can y'all see? Who's that girl? It's missing some pieces of skin. I think that's what Kip that ate. Was me. <laughs> Thank you, Jackie Adams. All right. Rhonda said we're going to get carjacked. That's what she's trying to tell us. Well, between you and Donna Fluids, I think we're going to do Uber Eats. They probably don't have Uber Eats. We're going to have a deliver, baby? Yes. Manchu. Manchu. Thank you, Hattie. All right. He ain't through with it. He's going to toss it in his Korean sauce he made up. Hello, Phyllis Goodman from Little Rock, Arkansas. All right. Y'all, it's hot in this kitchen. It's getting hot in here. All right, let's my, my. Wings make me happy. That's Gracie. I know that's the truth, Gracie. Hello, um, Yolanda Thomas. Thank you for joining us. It's a corner grocery. In and out. That's Donald. You <laughs> yes, it's a cast iron pot, Latanya. Went to a chicken place in Richmond. They put my chicken between two pieces of bread. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. <laughs> I got eating... He was eating it like a sandwich. Brother-in-law said, no, that's to soak up the oil. <laughs> See, the bread works two ways. You soak up the oil and you can eat it like a sandwich. 
Martha Nelson need two wings. That's a song. Two wings. All right. <laughs> we get ready to come out of here. Yes, it is, Carol Dunn. All right. Hot fish grease hot. I'm going to let that heat back up a little bit. We're going to put a little sauce on this. We about to toss some up. You want to come closer to me? Yeah, I'm gonna bring it to you. Wings and light bread. Yes, ma'am. Like hot cat, hot fish and light bread. If you can go and have fun under the bridge for Mardi Gras, then you'll be happy, glad we, to have that damn bridge. chicken. Not the rest of it. Gail yeah, Moore, we done been under we the bridge. Under the bridge for Mardi Gras. I got tired doing the liquor slide under the bridge. You right, Gail Moore. Carjacking happens around the graveyard. Stay with the others. <laughs> See, we got to write all these details down. I should have just waited to watch. My stomach is in my bike. Not back, it's bike. Joanne Renfro. So he just tossed the wings and some of that Korean sauce that he made. Uh, unbelievable aroma. Yes, it smells absolutely delicious. I'm Gucci hungry. That's the net man. Right, get your butt back up there. That my skin fell off. All right, now. Yes, yes. Him skin fell off. Y'all know he got to put some sprinkle on it. Mm hmm. That's a good chef. He can't have no drip drips on his plate. We're going to watch him make it rain. Thank you, DeQuincy Goins. Thank you, Jeanette Stilson. They look so good. That's uh, Lolita. Sprinkle some sesame seeds for the Asian flair. Thank you for the stars, Aldine Tucker. Is the sauce spicy? No, it's, it's just it's a... got a little bit of a kick, but not... I, I could have, but I didn't have. <laughs> <laughs> we didn't want to burn up here by the mouth. Yeah. So it's those are sesame sense. seeds. We're going to put a little black and white because that's how we get down. Black and white sex sesame seeds. The chicken is glistening. That's Danielle. Yes, ma'am. That's that sauce. And there go your green onions. Give it that Korean flair. You're drizzling, baby. Go ahead, baby. You're drizzling, baby. Go ahead, baby. <laughs> Just throw me three of them. That's then it. Thank you, Lisa. All right. There you go. All right. We have some Asian fried chicken wings. Yes, we do. I make a sauce with cane syrup, Tabasco, and garlic. Then I have it. I have the best nap. That's Donna. <laughs> well, there you go, folks. Those are the wings. Those are the wings? Yeah. We'll get a later because we got more. Well, I yeah. Try. <laughs> I got a fried wing. Cousin Ronnie Carter said he see you, baby, with these two fried wings. Oh, man. Twice fried wings. Thank you, Aldine Tucker. Guess I'll make me a sandwich. <laughs> That's Marilyn. I'm sorry, Ooh, sis. Baby, you remember last time? Ooh, you ain't let the chicken cool off. Come on, Tracy. Ooh, is the recipe going to be out there? Yes, I'm putting the recipe for the sauce. Can't get to them. And the ba too hot. babe, I could have told you it was going to be too hot. Thank you, Shirley Turner. I'm trying, y'all. I get that little tip. Come to the come come over, Tim. Babe, you know that chicken too hot. <laughs> <laughs> mm -hmm. Kip is sweating. Yeah, he's sweating. I'm outside knocking. Come on, little Lisa. No, them the real chicken wings, not wingettes. That was the whole wing. That's the whole wing. So Just folks, showing I'm off, Claudette. Let me get these out real quick. Okay, so that's the second fry. So he's not going to put sauce and dip all of them in the sauce. Some of them will be regular. That looks delicious. Thank you. Y'all, Gucci grown. That's that net mask. Debbie said, OMG. Right. Just try something different other than your traditional fried chicken. You can mix up a little sauce. I was trying to taste them. Babe, that's hot. 
Jacqueline the stars. Um, cousin Ronnie say he loved that Korean style sauce. Thank you, Itzy. Dang, Kip. Meat oh. on that bone. <laughs> Let it cool off. Dang, yes. I'm sorry. Give it a minute, everybody. I'm gonna have to give it a minute. <laughs> He was trying to taste it for y'all. The stars are something that you can send us uh, through the live to help support us. I'm not sure what it takes to, to be able to enable to send them. It's probably a setting that you have on your phone. Mm -hmm. All right. Have well, a happy well, Father's Day. So we get ready to wrap it up. Good. We got some wings. Stove still on, they said. Yeah. I got and a few more wings to cook. Okay. Um, it, we got some wings. It's Friday night. Um, tomorrow is Juneteenth. Juneteenth. So, uh, celebrate and be proud of where we come from. Mm -hmm. uh, from everything from um, uh, Black Wall Street to our original ancestors to um, being pioneers of this country. Mm -hmm. That's who we are. Um, so, happy Juneteenth. Enjoy some good food. Enjoy. All the fathers, happy Father's Day, and uh, hopefully we'll get a chance to see you tomorrow. We're going to do the okra again with Mom. She's going to do her thing. We're just going to ride the wave, all right? That's right. Have a good night. Thank y'all for time. joining Keep us. Keep a smile on your face. Love you. Peace. And we're going to get into this chicken that just came out of the grease. Peace, love, <laughs> and hot grease. <laughs> That's it. Y'all have a good one. Take care. All right. Lola, ready to, ready to dig in. I'll put you off camera. All right. Good night, guys. Yeah.